So basically I was on the internet yesterday and I was looking for Baldi videos, Baldi's Basics, you know that game. And then I found this one video called Amazon Baldi Limited Edition, which is one of those Amazon Echo memes. I clicked on there and I watched that partly. And then I clicked on the channel of the guy who made the video. It was called Roblox Lover 69. Hello, my name is Cheeseman and welcome back to another video. And like I just said, I'm going to be talking about the YouTuber Roblox Lover 69. So the kind of content Roblox Lover 69 makes is either Roblox gameplays or roleplay videos. So Roblox Lover 69 seems to have quite a interest in lying to his fans because he's lied in the past about how the first Roblox player is haunting him or that He's teaching Jake Paul how to play Roblox. These are obviously lies. If you've watched these videos, you see nothing actually happens. Especially if you watch the one with Jake Paul allegedly in it. He says, Oh, Jake Paul's not going to be talking right now. He's a little shy. He's just talking with Logan Paul about making a future vlog. It's fine. He's Well, I, I live right next to the Team 10 house. So we get to hang out a little bit, but he's a little shy. He's not going to talk this video. He's not going to talk this video, no. No. He clicked on the video to see Jake Paul? He, he's, he's just a little shy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. He's not shy to flex, though. No, no. He's just shy to talk on my channel. Because he's not really... I mean, he is here. He's just shy. That's basically that video in its entirety. <laughs> Although he does upload Roblox Let's Plays, I'm not really going to focus on that really. Uh, what you think about what's going to happen in the video is what you'll get. It's just him playing the video game. But the thing I want to be focusing on now is his roleplay. So basically what he does in his roleplay videos is he takes a few characters that he's made. Uh, the most popular setting he usually has in his videos are his, in the schoolhouse. The most recent video he's just uploaded was a roleplay video. It was a Baldi video saying how he became the man he is. Basically, the story is that Baldi comes to a new school just a week before final exams. Great parenting. I'll elaborate on the parenting of the characters later. And he flunks the test, and nobody likes him because they think he's dumb. He comes in and kills everybody with a ruler. And then, uh, then the next year, the kids come, and he's the teacher. So basically, the lesson we learned from this is massacres in schools don't only happen with guns. But anyways, besides that, like I said, the parenting. Most of the parents of the kids in the videos seem like they do not like their children at all. They're just like, oh, yeah, you're my son. Yeah, okay, great. I don't care. Don't do that thing. I won't like you if you do that. I don't want to be around you anymore. One video Roblox Lover 69 uploaded was one where the mother of a daughter didn't want to feed her child during the winter months, so she said, all right, I'm just going to fatten you up like a bear so you can hibernate, because that's definitely going to work. Forced feeding is a recurring topic in Roblox Lover 69's videos, but out of all the videos I've watched by him, the video that stands out to me the most is Most Evil Teacher Punishing Kid in parentheses, sad Roblox story where a student eats the cake that the teacher was planning to feed the entire class and then she's caught and tied up and then force fed the food and she looks like she's bleeding out of the mouth. But I'm gonna make you pay! You're gonna be fat as me by the time we're finished! Babe, I'm sorry! I'll never do it again! <laughs> Besides force feeding, there's also a big emphasis on bullying in these videos. Uh, like with the one I just talked about, the teacher is saying, Oh, I'm gonna chain you in front of the class and humil humiliate you in front of everybody. And then the people take out a camera and record her. So, as of now, there are the, the fetishes stacking on top of each other. And remember this, this is for kids. This is for kids. If you have a kid who's probably 13 or something, he's what and he's watching these videos, he's enduring this content and he doesn't even know it's bad. I know that people say that cartoons from the early 2000s were bad, but I'm going to be honest, kids content on YouTube is worse because on TV there's regulations, but with kids 
Not as much. We already had the big thing with the Elsa Gate and all this other stuff. And now we have over here, Roblox Lover 69 releasing his fetish content for all the young children to see. Anyways, that's really all I have to say about this man. He seems just like he has no life. I bet some of you are thinking, I'm gonna leave a rude comment on this guy's video. Well, he's disabled comments, ratings, and how many subscribers he has. You can't see any of these things. You can't see how many dislikes he has. He's probably removed all this stuff because he kept getting hate for all the dumb stuff he's been doing. So, he's kind of a bitch. Sorry, but if you didn't, if you disable likes and ratings and subscribers, you're kind of a bitch. You can't take criticism. But anyways, thanks for watching the video. I appreciate everybody who subscribed. I've had the largest subscriber growth that I've had on my channel for a while. I got 11 subscribers this past month. And I want to thank all of you who subscribed. And I'm sorry that I couldn't get content out quicker. I was focused on another video that I was having trouble making. That video should probably come out tomorrow. And then more videos will come out after that. And if there's any complications in the future, I'll tell you then. Thanks for watching the video. Remember to like, subscribe share the video, turn on that bell notification because YouTube is messing up subscribers, and that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.